No, it's great. I mean, it's good to see, you know, so many more teams than when I was playing. And to just be able to have a weekend where you bring everyone together, everyone's under one roof, and, you know, you just get a lot of exposure, you get a lot of good hockey. I mean, it's only going to be, it's only going to be good for the, for the growth of the players. So, weekends like this are kind of special for me. Honestly, like, they've done such a great job putting this on. Uh, everyone at Maha, it's, it makes sense, right? It's the start of the year. It's kind of the first kind of view of these guys. Um, and to have them all under one roof, it's, it's nice for colleges. It's nice for, I'm sure, a lot of the junior teams that are here as well. It's a kind of one-stop job. Um, you get to, get to see everyone. It's all at one ring. It's a beautiful facility here, obviously, in Troy. Um, they've done such a great job of, you know, putting the game to a pretty friendly, uh, time frame so you get to kind of see a lot of different games. Games aren't really overlapping a ton, which is great. Um, it's been a fantastic event. It's been a great event. So we, this is our fourth year, third year doing it. We took the year off from COVID, of course, but it's our third time doing it. It's kind of our kickoff weekend. And uh, it's good that all nine North organizations in Michigan together and put this on. It gives our the scouts a chance to see our Michigan teams, Michigan kids, play for the game this season. And now that we're adding the second event in December, which is December 9th weekend, the same place with Troy, those scouts can come back and see them again. And then actually, you know, culminate at the state playoffs, which will be down to Taylor. And we hope to have just build a just build an exciting atmosphere here and just get people more excited about what we're trying to do in, in Maha and Michigan hockey.